<laughs> I've got you, you little thief. That's me, Treasure. Don't think you can just run off with it. Catch him and tear him to bits. Hello, everybody. This is Dragon Kirby, and welcome back to Hero the King of Root, round two. Uh, this is my second recording of doing this because, uh, for some reason, Streamlabs decided to mess up, and I recorded to the to I recorded this and the next video all with um with both. With all the gameplay not appearing at all. So, now I'm stuck with having to do this. Either I either had to redo the entire game to get this to work properly, or. Or. Sorry for the burp. Or re just replay all the stages while pointing out all. Worrying out where stuff is. So I decided to go with the latter because. Because I wasn't going to try to replay 90% of the game just to get to you get back to where we were. I'm hoping you can forgive me for for this, and I'm hoping I can point out everything that. I've collected, even though it's not the, it's not perfect. It's the best I could do on short notice because if I noticed this earlier, I wouldn't have, I would, this would be the only video I would fix, I would have to fix. But since I didn't, I'm stuck with trying to fix this myself. But I can, uh, try my best to be, uh, entertaining while dealing with my mess up. After this, you get a cutscene of me of Ko walking over here, and the pirate that told us to give us the money, but asked us if we had him. We would give him the three thousand coins, giving us about over one thousand left, and then we could walk in and enter the abandoned town. As it's obvious, uh, the co there are coins. There are coins in these containers right here, and basically any crate you see is going to have a. It's most likely going to have a coin in it. There were coins around this pile of these. Po this pile of unbreakable crates. I believe there also may have been either a star or maybe some gems over here as well. But most likely they're all coins, from my memory. Over here, as I said when I first recorded this, I missed this the first time playing. But there's this area full of that would be full of coins and with some gems and stars. I'm not going to try to break all the crates like I did again because it's kind of obvious. If you see a crate, uh, there's a coin in it. Like the crates and stuff in here. And over there. 
So let's go over here. I want to hop out here, and I'm going to go to uh, a, like a first person view real quick. This box right there, I'll t I'll say how you can get it, but that also has a coin. There were some. Uh, there is a couple of stars over there. more boxes with some coins in them. I'm gonna activate the lift. Sadly, we're gonna miss something really funny that happened in the last, when I first recorded. I'll, ex I'll explain once we get there. There's some more barrels and such. And to get to that one crate I pointed out, we would want to fly over here. And you would use uh, the hover to land on that ledge right there. Right there, that ledge right there, and jump over to break it. When I first tried to record this, the one that failed, I failed to, I had to, I failed jumping there twice and had to re-go through, I had to go through this gauntlet twice to get the box and then have to go through the gauntlet again to get back here. There's some coins around in this area and we can press the button with more coins being around this area. I believe there's also a couple of gems, I believe, maybe, if I'm correct, but there's some coins over, there were coins over here. And, uh, I will explain, we do have infinite boomerangs, if you didn't notice. That's the reward you get for collecting all 250 co stars. As you see, there's 255, I'll explain that in the next episode, or in our, the last part. The finale, because the finale will hatch, it will explain why there's five. Unless, well, there's also the fact that you most likely saw the the, the, the total of the next uh, the next level when I was go trying to get to the next part or next level or this level. I cannot speak. I'm trying to fix this and I can't even speak. There were some coins surrounding this section. And then there's these beds. There were also some uh, stars and gems and coins hidden behind these piles of boxes. It's kind of hard to miss as long as you keep your eye out. There are also some coins strewn about the ledges of this, I guess, the top of the wall. I believe there's some coins over here. With some coins and a couple stars hiding in this corner. gonna power through here I don't believe there was any coins on the walkway but there were coins in this hall and coins down this hall and I believe there are also some coins on the way down here I, I don't think so but I believe there's also some there may have been a couple coins on this path If I missed something, it most likely was on the path that we are that we were walking on, and it would be impossible to miss. 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 There we go. Over here, there are some stars and coins, and I believe a couple of gems as well. 
And I'm avoiding these because of course there's gonna be stars in them. There is also some stars in this area. I can't give the exact amount because I'm not, I'm, I don't have the best memory. I'm going with what I have. I believe there may have been a couple of like Ow. something hit. I believe like a gem or a star hidden behind this crate, Ow. and maybe something we hidden behind that crate. I'm hoping if I'm correct. But luckily, on this path right here, there is absolutely, positively no coins, no stars, nothing whatsoever. So there's nothing to worry about when I talk about this section. Because all the items that the last few items we're here to collect are not going to be on this. Luckily, very linear and not very tough path. Please ignore the death I had earlier. There we go. There were a couple coins on top of, I believe, on top of this pile of crates. And of course, there were some, I believe there's some coins strewn about over here, around, along with the, the barrels and such. So, now this level, this won't be very a very long video because of I, me already collecting them, so there's not, not a lot to talk about. But, uh, that's the end of this. That's the end of Abandoned Town. I'm sorry that this is going to be th how this and the last episode is going to be. I'm really sorry. I wasn't expecting, uh, recording issues to happen right at the last two episodes. So... <laughs> If you, if so, even if you did, uh, so I hope you did enjoy me trying my best to explain where things were. I'm hoping I didn't miss anything. And I hope you have a, I hope you enjoyed this anyway, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Next time, I'll see you when we talk about the, where I try to explain the, my, the best of my abilities the last episode. Or the last level, and we're going to fight off the hunter and save our animal friends. See you all next time. Goodbye.